I'm so excited to announce, finally, my favorite game of all time, Sudokan. Sudokan. The Sudokan series is my favorite game series of all time. My favorite JRPG of all time. Sudokan 2 is my top game of all time. And finally, a spiritual successor from the original creator is coming out. If you guys haven't heard, check it out. This is awesome. It's called Eduin Chronicles 100 Heroes. And right now it's being crowdfunded in Kickstarter. So check it out in Kickstarter. Support it. The Kickstarter campaign is seeking half a million dollars. And it's coming out for uh, PS5. Wow. PlayStation 5, Xbox X, Switch. Oh my god, this is coming out for the PS5. This is awesome. I'm definitely going to support this. I've never supported anything on Kickstarter before. Um, and I know that sounds terrible. This is starting on the 27th and is running until the 28th. I'm definitely going to support this game. Um, wow. Um, so the guy that wrote Sudokan is writing... The, the guy that wrote Sudokan 1 and 2 is writing this game alongside alongside other veterans that worked on Sudokan. One of them being the artist of Sudokan 1, I believe. And Sudokan 4, I, I could be wrong, but I know I think she's an artist. Um, this is unbelievable. This is unbelievable because Konami made a mockery out of my favorite series. They made a complete mockery out of Kojima with his Metal Gear Solid series. And finally, the creator of Sudokan 1 and 2 is finally stepping up and doing what was his to begin with. And as you can see here, there's six party members, I believe. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so you got the six party battle. You got the classic looking monsters. You got this, the, the symmetric uh, the symmetric battle. It looks beautiful, man. It looks beautiful, and please support this game. I, I'm lost for words, guys. I mean, you can read this article. I'll post this article on, on the description below. Um, the, the creator's talking here, and he tells you a little bit about the games. There's 100 heroes. Um... And then he goes on to say, I read it somewhere on the bottom. Um, he was explaining how it's kind of like Sudokan. You have blacksmiths, you have chefs, you have all these different personalities, you see? Um, personalities in your 100-person army. And you have a fortress that grows, kind of like Sudokan, the castle that grows. And they have different jobs. Um, so there's going to be blacksmithing like, like in the other Sudokan games. And apparently he just said this is the tip of the iceberg. Meaning, there's a lot more to come, guys. And I always wanted to know, what was Sudokan look like by the original creator if it was brought to the next-gen console? We all wanted to know that. And now here it is. This guy looks just like the Sudokan 1 main character. It's finally here, man. This is awesome, and I can't wait for that, guys. Um... Yeah, I mean, guys, go on and support this game because this game is awesome. And I, I have nothing else to say, guys. Sudokan is my favorite series. If you guys haven't heard what Sudokan 2 is or Sudokan 1, look it up. It came out around the 90s, and it's my favorite game of all time. So you see these two right here are the key, key components of this. That's the writer and that's the artist. These two are the key components to this. I cannot wait. I'm excited about Captain Sabas Rising New Champion. And that's coming out on the 28th when this game, uh, the crowdfunding stops. You know, and now I'm super excited about this game. Guys, this crowdfunding um, is not going to run for that long. So please, please support this game. If you are a JRPG fan, if you are a Final Fantasy fan, if you are a Sudokan fan, support this game. This game is awesome. It's going to be awesome. Sudokan is awesome. The creator that wrote Sudokan has a beautiful story. Because I read... Um, let me see if I can pull that article up so I can show you guys. Give me one second. God, I just noticed. Um, I'm still going to show you that other information. But I just noticed there's a video here. Let's check this video out. I haven't seen it yet. Let's check it out. Let's see this awesome... Wow, that was amazing. Oh my god, that was amazing. That was by IGN Japan. 
I'm gonna subscribe to them right now. Wow, that was crazy. Give me the notifications. Whoa. Oh my god. Guys. But um what I was gonna show you okay, so it has six member battle, says it right there. So just like Sudikin, um <clears throat> I read somewhere too that they um, this game has like uh, a lot of cultures and race like elves, beastmen, humans. Um, there was another one I forgot the other race. There's different races, different cultures, diversities. There's different nations, so it's just like Sudikin. Everything is just like Sudikin, like you saw in that video. This is two point D graphics, so it's almost three D. It's still pixel, but it's like a high definition level of pixelation. Guys, I'm super excited. I hope you guys are. Check this game out. Crowdfund it if you can. If not, that's okay. But hopefully this game makes it. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Catch you guys next time. Thank you so much.